in life for free. So you've had your cheap little thrill. And what the hell do you want, sicko? I want money. We can expect lots of trouble from Rosie. Um, because I was quite busy, I, was, I mean I was quite quiet for a period and um, I was so excited because um, I got these, this wad of scripts and I read them through and I was just like, oh, the stuff is absolutely amazing and she's just unbelievable, the things that she says and the things that she's going to get up to is great and it's just so much fun. I was like, I'm really going to take career advice from somebody who probably has to pee in a bucket every morning. Basically, um, Rosie ends up seeing John because she gets a letter for, um, through the post and um, obviously she's like really, really intrigued by it and she goes to the prison and um, she thinks, oh, I'm going to really, really dress up and show him that I'm not scared of him anymore, you know, with the whole attic thing and everything. So, And she's like, you know, the one that's in control and everything. And um, John's trying to tell her something and... Um, Rose has been really, really mean and nasty to him. Now, are you going to tell me what all this is about? Otherwise, unlike you, I'm out of here. Which, understandably, because, you know, we did lock her in an attic. <laughs> but, um, so he's trying to um, tell her anyway that he's actually going to give her £150,000 um, that, that he inherited from his grandma. After I'd settled all her debts, there was still quite a lot left. It won't make up for what I've done, but... Well, how much? £150,000. And Rosie can't quite believe it. And she's like, well, what do I have to do for it, you know? And um, he's just like, nothing. And he's been really quite noble and nice and thing. And Rose is just outrageous. It would mean a lot to me if something positive came out of all of this. Oh, get over yourself. You're not Santa or the secret millionaire. I absolutely love playing my character. She is so much fun and I really, um, I, I love the bits. I mean, I know she's, she's, uh, she's, she's horrible and things, but she's outrageous and it's so much fun to be able to play a character like that. So I shall take the money, but I shall spend it how I want to. I mean, first of all, she kind of splurges on designer handbags and champagne but um, there is something she might be quite clever and make an investment by um, some certain persuasion by someone so you'll have to wait and see but um, it's very 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 interesting um, yeah it's really really good